I have some exciting news to share today regarding social security and stimulus checks. According to reports that just came out this morning, the government will be issuing a new round of $2,000 stimulus checks specifically for seniors starting from today. This is absolutely huge news and something so many retirees and social security beneficiaries have been desperately waiting for. After facing rising costs due to inflation, many seniors have been struggling financially and were hoping for additional relief. Now it seems that relief is almost here. In the first four minutes of this video, I really want to drive home just how impactful this announcement is. This extra $2,000 can help cover essential costs like food, housing, transportation, and medical care. For the millions of seniors who rely primarily on Social Security, this stimulus money could not be coming at a better time. Not only that, but the fact that an entire new wave of checks is being sent shows that the government recognizes seniors have been disproportionately impacted by our current economic climate. They need more support, and sending recurring payments is a great way to provide that support. I mean, just think about what a difference an extra $2,000 can make in the life of a retiree or Social Security beneficiary. It can help them afford repairs around the house, transportation for doctor appointments, or simply give them some financial breathing room. For many, this check could be the difference between getting by and thriving. And the government sending these checks directly also means there's no complicated application process. If you're receiving Social Security benefits, the payment should arrive automatically the way previous stimulus amounts have. It's just a matter of watching your bank account for the extra deposits. Now in the next section of this video, let's go over exactly who qualifies for these new $2,000 stimulus checks arriving Monday. First and foremost, you must be a recipient of Social Security in some form. This includes retirees who receive retirement benefits, as well as people receiving Social Security Disability Insurance or Supplemental Security Income. As long as you have received Social Security benefits at some point in 2022, you'll qualify. One important thing to note is that these stimulus checks are only being sent to seniors and Social Security beneficiaries. Other previous eligibility requirements like having a certain income level or dependent children do not apply this time around. If you haven't received Social Security benefits before, unfortunately you won't be receiving one of these upcoming checks. They're reserved specifically for the senior community to provide financial relief. However, advocates are still pushing for a broader 4TH stimulus check, so there's still hope more payments could be approved in the future. For those seniors who receive Social Security benefits via direct deposit, you can expect the $2,000 payment to hit your bank account this Monday, January 23 road. The government is working to send the money as fast as possible so people can immediately use the funds. Now, if you typically receive your benefit checks by mail, it may take a little bit longer to receive your stimulus payment. But the government expects all paper checks to be mailed by the end of next week at the latest. So if you don't see that money by February 1 SD, reach out to the Social Security Administration for assistance. At this point, the most important thing is just watching your bank account or mailbox. This extra financial support should be arriving very soon thanks to the coordinated efforts of the SSA. And think about how many essential expenses this $2,000 can help you cover. For some, it may be wise to save a portion of the stimulus money in your emergency fund in case additional costs come up. But it's also understandable to want to use the funds immediately for pressing needs. Just having that financial flexibility and breathing room can be such a relief. This stimulus announcement couldn't have come at a better time. With inflation still painfully high, many have been financially struggling. I'm so glad to see the government is taking action to provide more support and relief, at least for our senior community. This $2,000 will truly make a difference. As I wrap up this video, I first just want to express how excited I am for everyone receiving these new stimulus checks on Monday. I know they will positively impact so many lives. This is what effective policy looks like our government recognizing a struggling group and taking action to help. My hope is that these recurring payments don't stop here. Our seniors deserve long-term solutions to keep their heads above water during these difficult economic times. But for now, let's celebrate this huge win. I really want to focus on the news itself and the implications of what it could mean for seniors and retirees. As many of you know, Social Security is extremely important for millions of Americans, but the monthly payments are often not enough to cover all living expenses. 
That's where a possible 4TH stimulus check could come in to provide additional financial relief. According to the latest reports, lawmakers are considering proposing more stimulus checks and increases in Social Security benefits to help offset rising inflation. Prices have been surging on everything from food to gas to housing, putting a real pinch on people living on fixed incomes. A fourth stimulus check with potentially larger Social Security payments could provide real help. Now I don't want to overpromise anything here. These are just proposals being discussed and would need to be passed by Congress before becoming a reality. However, the fact that they are being considered is definitely promising news. Even an extra few hundred dollars per month could make a real difference for seniors trying to make ends meet. The possibility of these larger Social Security payments and additional stimulus checks comes at a critical time. Inflation hit a 40-year high last month, with prices rising 7% from a year ago. From the grocery store to the gas pump, retirees are getting squeezed financially. Meanwhile, the annual cost of living adjustment for Social Security was only 5.9% for 2022, falling short of actual inflation. This mismatch between inflation and Social Security colas is precisely why lawmakers are looking at issuing another stimulus check and boosting the monthly Social Security payments. They recognize the real pain people are experiencing right now from skyrocketing costs. This fourth stimulus check would aim to provide some additional relief from those price hikes. Now let's talk about who might qualify for these potential Social Security increases and additional stimulus checks if they are approved. First, the Social Security benefit boosts. Not everyone would necessarily see an increase in their monthly payments. The proposed legislation would primarily boost payments for retirees and seniors who rely on Social Security for the majority of their retirement income. So those with income from other sizable sources, like pensions, investments, rental properties, etc. may not qualify for the boosted Social Security benefits. The increases are aimed at lower-income seniors who are wholly or mostly dependent on Social Security. When it comes to the potential 4TH stimulus checks, eligibility requirements may be similar to previous stimulus payments. Individuals earning below certain income limits probably $75,000 per year or less would likely qualify. Checks would also go out to married couples earning less than around $150,000 per year. Additionally, seniors who collect SSI or SSDI benefits but not regular Social Security retirement benefits may also be eligible for both the boosted Social Security payments and 4TH stimulus checks. More details are expected if these proposals gain traction in Congress. Now, Let's discuss how you can apply for these potential Social Security increases and additional stimulus checks if they are approved. For the Social Security benefit increases, the application process would likely be simple. Since the Social Security Administration already has your income data, they may automatically adjust monthly payments for those who qualify. Individuals may not need to apply separately. However, keep an eye out for any announcements from the Social Security Administration just in case any application is needed. They will publicize details on eligibility and the application process if these benefit increases become reality. I'll be sure to share those updates right here as soon as they are available. Applying for the 4TH stimulus checks would work similarly to the previous rounds of direct payments. For those who qualify based on tax returns already submitted, payments could be issued automatically by the IRS. However, some people needed to provide additional information through an online non-filer form to get prior stimulus checks, usually because they don't normally file tax returns. The IRS would likely reopen something similar if another round is approved. I will provide all the details needed on how to complete that process quickly and easily to ensure you get your stimulus money. The key takeaway here is that more money could soon be coming to seniors and retirees through Social Security payment increases and additional stimulus checks but nothing is guaranteed yet. I will stay on top of all developments out of Washington and immediately share any updates on eligibility, payment amounts, and timelines as we get them. These proposals are clearly acknowledgments by lawmakers that inflation is hammering the finances of people on fixed incomes. They aim to provide real assistance. I'm feeling optimistic that they recognize the unique pain seniors are facing right now, but we have to wait and see if these measures make it into law. In the meantime, please hit like and subscribe to be sure you don't miss any updates. Comment below with your thoughts on this news. Do you think the chances are good for more stimulus checks and social security increases? 
How much of a difference would this extra money make for you? Share your thoughts. I love hearing from all of you. Retiring can be one of life's most rewarding milestones, but it also requires diligent financial planning well in advance. With the right preparations, you can enjoy your golden years while living comfortably on your available income sources like Social Security. Here are some key tips. The first step is understanding precisely how much you can expect to receive from Social Security. Create an online account at ssa.gov to view your latest statement showing estimated benefits at age 62, your full retirement age, and age 70. This will help you identify any gaps between your benefits and projected expenses in retirement. Aim to save 10-15% of your income throughout your working years. The 401k and IRA are great options, allowing your money to grow tax-deferred. Consistent contributions to these and other retirement accounts will accumulate substantial savings over time. Entering retirement with any kind of debt mortgage, credit cards, auto loans, etc. will eat into your income. Develop a payoff strategy for loans years in advance of retiring so you owe as little as possible when you stop working. Debt places unwanted strain on limited retirement funds. Determine how much you can safely withdraw from retirement accounts each year without running out of money. Many experts suggest limiting withdrawals to 4 or 5% annually. Remember, retirement can last 20 years or more, so pace your withdrawals appropriately. Social Security, 401k withdrawals, pensions and other sources should combine to provide adequate income. Have a plan if your projected income falls short or threaten your nest egg sustainability. Options include delaying retirement, reducing expenses, or working part-time. Medical costs increase with age, so review your health insurance options like Medicare. Plan for out-of-pocket costs beyond what insurance covers, including deductibles, copays, and prescription drugs. These expenses can significantly impact retirement finances. Your cost of living can vary dramatically based on location. Avoid expensive areas if possible. Relocating to a lower-cost town, state, or even country may allow your retirement income to stretch much further. The key is reviewing your finances holistically to set yourself up for retirement success. Determine all likely income sources, budget expected monthly spending, account for healthcare, consider relocating if helpful and continue saving diligently. With the right financial foundation, you can look forward to thriving in your golden years.